my beloved love. Now, I am getting that for 80% of people who are resonating with this message. This is actually romantic in nature. So not necessarily, but for many of you, this may actually be multiple potential romantic suitors who are fighting for you in the sense that they are vying for your time, attention, energy, or for your love, for your romantic commitment. Now I'm getting that for someone listening, this could actually be futuristic. So this could be a dynamic that you are going to be experiencing in the near future. And so you could be getting a bit of a heads up that you are going to be having a lot of competing forces when it comes to love in your romantic life. But I feel that this is because people do recognize the high value of this high vibrational energy that you carry. For some of you, this sense of competing or fighting for you could actually be platonic, and it could be simply a lot of people wanting to get into your energy, wanting your time, wanting your advice. I just keep hearing people highly value your energy at this time. It's almost like you are suddenly coming online into people's consciousness after this period of solitude, and people are wondering, whoa, where did this energy, where did this person come from? It's like they came out of nowhere and appeared with this really magical high vibrational essence, and I want to experience connection with some of that. That's what I'm picking up. I almost feel that your frequency was masked. Your vibration was shielded from or masked from the collective consciousness and is now being unveiled. So I know that's a very strange message, and once again, it could just be for a few people listening, but what I'm picking up is that there was that period of time that I'm referring to as your period of solitude. During that time, part of why you felt so lonely, I'm hearing unseen. You may have literally felt like you didn't exist. This is hard to find words for, but it's like you almost felt like you weren't a human or weren't a person because you just really couldn't lock into a community, to a social environment, to a physical environment that felt really consistent and felt really stable and connected socially. But part of the reason for this is, I feel someone's spirit guides here were actually protecting your energy or shielding. I see them like putting a wall around your vibration, your frequency, so that for a period of time, you could focus solely on yourself without distraction, so that you could do that necessary inner work that you've done. I'm hearing, so you could take that inner journey within yourself that you've now taken and really solidly come into a knowing of who you are at a deep core soul level without the distraction of other energies, people, and situations. But again, this was very divinely orchestrated for the purpose of actually allowing you to clarify, purify, and amplify your own core soul frequency. From Divine Muscular Type yes, if you believe, 